Hello and welcome back to our 1.4 update, well, summary really, where we're going to be looking at what is new in the 1.4 update that came out yesterday. Now, uh, if you haven't seen the last video, then please do, but uh, for, uh, in this video we're going to be looking at a few part, a few things that's pretty much part of the Halloween part of this um, update. So if we look here, we ha we're pretty much going to be looking at the scary section. So, um, first things first, I think we're g uh, I would like to show you uh, this zombie infection. So you can see here that what I have is this particular um, mob. Uh, I'm not quite sure why it's sunk into the ground, so sorry about that. But here it is. It kind of looks like a cross between a villager and a um, and, and a uh, zombie. You'll see here that what the um, oh, I don't want it to die on me. Okay, right. So, yep, there we go. Right. So here it here it actually is now that it's finished lagging out. Uh, you can see it right there. So let's just see how it, how it, how well, what it does really. Now these, um, <coughs> sorry, these zombie villagers are naturally spawning. There is a uh, every time a zombie spawns, there is a one in ten chance that it will be kind of half villager. So if I now place like a villager here, the infected villager will pretty much. It won't infect the village, uh, the other villages, but 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 it will pretty much kill it. Um, some um, something else that is new that wasn't actually on that poster, which I think I briefly mentioned earlier, is the fact that there is new sounds. So, um, like the skeleton sound has changed. If we just hit the skeleton, you'll see that the bones crackling is slightly different if you hear. Yep, there it is. There are a lot of different changes as well to the sounds. Now, what else could we have a look at? Well, let's just take a look here. We have wither skeletons. We'll take a look at that in a sec. Now, before I get onto the wither boss, which is pretty scary, um, I just want to take a look at these creeper heads. Uh, now, you can get lots of different masks in the 1.4 update. So, basically, if I get this mask... I can put it on my head, and then if you look, I'm kind of like a skel uh, like a creeper, really, or what uh, whatever mob I put on. Now I'm just going to come down here. Uh, I'm just going to set the time today so we can see a little better, which will evidently kill all the mobs, of course. Why wouldn't it? And now here, what I'm going to do is I am going to get a splash potion of invisibility just to show you how this works so if I just splash this down here and now if we look at me in third person you'll see that I am now just a little rather rather strange floating creeper head which is quite interesting so yeah uh, that's one of the purposes of the masks that you can now get another purpose of the wither skulls that you can get the wither masks that you can use it to actually spawn a wither boss but before we do that I would just like to before this world pretty much gets gets destroyed by the wither uh, I just want to show you um, a little addition that came along with witches which is actually bats if you look here I'm not quite sure what these bats actually do but as you can see there are bats that can that can spawn if you look here um, right, now let's spawn this lovely wither. In order to do this, there isn't actually a spawn egg. You need to build it like you would do with an iron golem. So here we have soul sand. And with the soul sand, I'm going to make it. So the way you make it is you put that there. You pretty much may make the bottom of it. And now here, a wither actually has three heads. So what we're going to need to do is, we are going to need to get 
three of these with the skeleton skulls and this is what will make the wither so we we need to put three of them along the top so I'm gonna put one there one there and one there and there we have our wither right now it's just charging up but yeah now this wither is will pretty much destroy anything that anything that isn't evil basically it'll try to kill me it'll kill a load of cows pigs it'll it'll, it'll just kill any living thing really except from uh its allies so zombies and skeletons and stuff so you see it's just gone over there deciding to kill anything that's in its path really it is it kind of shoots heads as cannonballs and like well explosives really which is pretty freaky so there we go uh, sorry about that the wither's making my minecraft laugh so there we go there's a pretty freaky wither as you can see here it's just destroying everything it is shooting any living creature like that poor little pig down there and they are pretty hard to kill. So if you're doing a survival, I don't, don't recommend spawning a wither being your objective, to be honest. Since it will destroy anything. It is a very powerful boss mob. Um, mob which has just got stuck, which is lovely. So now that it's actually stuck, um, because of blocks, we can have a, look at them. have a look at it in more detail. You can see here. It is. It it does look pretty strange and scary. Look, pretty freaky. And if I actually go on survival, it will pretty much just nuke me. It's, if you look here, it's just it's just gonna weigh in explosives on top of me. I'm gonna quickly switch back to creative just before I die. And I ju just want to show you something else. So let's just look here. We've looked at pretty much everything except wither skeletons. Um, uh, yeah, so um, wither skeletons are actually skeletons that are in the nether. There is a very high chance that there that wither skeletons spawn in the nether. Now, the nether might make my Minecraft lag crazy because I'm recording, but I'm going to take a risk and give it a shot anyway. So I'm just going to make a normal nether portal to the nether. I'm going to oh look a piggy. We're going to get um flint and steel. And now let's just quickly make a nether portal. There we go. Oh and then up here. Yep, and then I think I'm making this right. Shoe piggy. There we go. Nearly there, folks. There we go. And there's our. I think that's our nether portal. Yep. Um. Did I make that big enough? And um, we'll find out. So if I just like this now. Oh, and I am immediately. I think being teleported. So that is basically what is new in 1.4. I'm going to try and show you with oh, oh god. I'm going to try and show you with the skeletons. It probably won't work though. Or oh, maybe it will. Okay, so basically when you spawn actually this is quite a nice place to test. When when I spawn, try to spawn a skeleton. Skeletor in the nether it will actually be one of these a wither skeleton I've actually never seen one before they look quite freaky oh god horrible memories of the wither um, so now I, I just want to kill this one and challenge this one it looks quite interesting it's something I find interesting is there's no bow but now that I've killed one it's given me its sword which is quite interesting and so I'm guessing that's how that's how skeletons work. I assume they naturally spawn in the nether. I can't confirm that. And that's pre that's that is that is pretty much all the major things that have happened in 
So thank you very much for watching um, this um, 1.4 update. Well, what's new really? Um, and goodbye for now. If you like this video, then please subscribe to um, keep them coming. And goodbye.